to you guys. <laughs> oh, thanks, Jane. It's uh, yeah, we've had lots of uh, emails coming in. Thank you so much for all of that. We'll bring you all of your um, slugs and snails comments and how you how you stop them eating your squashes a little bit later on the program. Yeah, Ken is saying mussel shells stop the slugs, and Sarah says rolled oats. Slugs love them, distracts them. Plenty more to come. Do stay with us. Headlines coming up. Don't get distracted. Literally. Live from London, this is BBC News. Millions have until just before midnight tonight to register to vote in the general election. With just over two weeks to go, parties return to the campaign trail. In other news, Russian President Vladimir Putin is on his way to North Korea after praising the country for supporting Russia's war in Ukraine. Warnings to tourists in Greece after four die and ancient sites are closed in record-breaking temperatures. And Sir Ian McKellen says he's in good spirits after falling off stage during a performance in London. Hello and welcome to BBC News. I'm Marianne Mashiri. Millions of eligible people are being urged to register to vote in order to have their say in the general election ahead of the deadline just before midnight tonight. Previous voters who've moved address, changed their nationality or their name will also need to re-register. It comes as parties return to the campaign trail today with just over two weeks left until polling day. Here's our political correspondent, Ben Wright. <laughs> I'm going to put this on the front. Yes. I'm wrong across the picture. 